I'm Melissa Gonzalez and we're outside of the Roger Smith pop-up shop at the Roger Smith Hotel. RS Pop has popped up today at Fashion Art Gallery, selling the future of fashion. Scan for identification. <laughs> is still on, right? I'm standing out front with Kelly Mills of Fashion Art Gallery, and she's going to give us a little bit of an explanation about what the future holds for fashion. Freedom. And you should actually focus on being yourself. We made a few short film clips that talk about that, talk about thinking not outside the box, but thinking where the box no longer exists. We are talking about sneaking into events. <laughs> instead of waiting in line or waiting to be uh, VIP. So fashion in the future is really about individual freedom. Tell me a little bit about what you're wearing today. I'm actually wearing Laquan Smith. This is spandex gold stretchy. The shoes are Melissa shoes. This is a Zaha Hadid collaboration with Melissa shoes. Um, this outfit is very comfortable. I know it looks perforated and, and almost like I'm wearing uh, almost uh, like an armor, but it's stretchy. And that's what gives its futuristic appeal is that it appears to be one way, but when you really look at it from a different perspective, it's something totally different. Hi. Hi. So we have Laquan Smith. He is the designer behind Kelly Mills outfit and a whole lot more. A lot of people are watching what you're doing today. So what's in store for Laquan's next line? Well, we're actually um, doing a little bit of avant-garde pieces. Everything is inspired by Marie Antoinette. So we're actually taking it up a notch for the girls this spring and allowing the girls to be able to dress how women used to dress. When you look around New York City, when you look around the world of America, women don't dress the way that they used to. So I think for this season, we're definitely going to take it up a notch, a lot more uh, wearable, more functional ball gowns, which is I'm really excited about. So I'm, I'm excited about creating uh, spring summer. Always keep on a five and a half inch, always. Five and a half. Nothing below. Beauty hurts. Yeah. Beauty hurts. And it elongates your legs and it makes you look a lot more lean and tall and slim. And I think that that's perfect for every woman. That sounds great. I, I have to try to be braver with my heels. No, but I'm we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna meet up with one of uh, two of the other designers that are part of tonight's collaboration. They are the women behind Original Women. Hi ladies. Hi, Hi. how are you? Good. Nice. Good. Thank you. And so much fun. Thank you, we're glad you're here. So can you tell us a little bit about what you're, uh, you're contributing to the Fashion Art Gallery pop-up shop? We have products made by women from around the world. So designers and traditional products and everything is made by women. And we believe in giving back. So as you know, a percentage of the proceeds goes to help support care, which really enables women and um, young girls all over the world to do better and to achieve more. And we think that it's really important to give back. Okay, now we're here with Mari J. Brooklyn, and you are a star in all of the commercials for the Fashion Art Gallery pop-up shop. So tell us a little bit about what your, uh, what your uh, art is doing in this. Um, I, I make this necklace. This is like, I love African fabric, and I'm putting this stone, this one, different color. Uh, inspired 2020, but I oh, I make handmade. <laughs> so they look great, yeah. and I love your hat. Oh, That's good. awesome. Yeah. Okay, so now I'm out front with Telfar, who is uh, a part of the Fashion Art Gallery. Tell us a little bit about your contribution to the installation. Um, I have my shoes in here this season, and also my co collaboration with American Apparel. Uh -huh. So yeah, um, that's my contribution. And, and always, like, there's everybody that's in our showroom, Fashion Art Gallery, it has a lot of really cool things. Everybody needs a pair of their Converse, because I love to rock mine. So, <laughs> and tell us a little bit about what's coming out next with your new line. Um, I'm working on a collection for fall 2010, and I should, I will be showing during Fashion Week, so. Can you give us a sneak hint about what's coming up? Um, it's very masculine and is very formal. Great. So. And if you could give us... Everything else is under wraps. Everything. 
If you could give us one fashion tip for the fall, what would it be? For the summer, actually. For the summer, I like, I like arms, no sleeves. <laughs> no sleeves. Biceps curls, triceps dips, keep it sexy. Now we're outside with Leo of Evident Future, which makes absolute sense that you be part of the Future of Fashion's closet. Definitely. So tell us a little bit about your design. Um, well, basically, I am working on my collection now, which is to launch for fall winter 2010. Uh, just kind of grabbing a lot of aesthetics from women's fashion and incorporating some men's fashion. I felt like fashion's been a little boring for men, so I kind of wanted to bring in a new element where I would take high shoulder pieces, pieces with functionality to them, and incorporate them into fashion. I think that I agree. I think men should definitely be bolder. If you could give one fashion tip for the summer for men, what would it be? One fashion tip would be express yourself. Fashion's art, express yourself all day. Now we're out front with Gabriel in Tandem Magazine. So you're one of the sponsors tonight. Tell us about your involvement in the future of fashion closet. Oh, well, it was exciting to work with Kelly. And um, pretty much we just collaborated on different ideas on how we wanted to kind of showcase what's going to go on here and kind of cross promote each other's projects. What kind of looks uh, is in Tandem Magazine anticipating for the next season? Um. I don't know, it's hard to predict those things. I don't know, let's not predict, let's just be surprised. I play with my hair, it's really easy to do. Have fun with your hair. <laughs> it's, a, it's a great way to have an accessory to your outfit. Yeah. And what's your website? Um, in tandemmagazine.com. This is Melissa Steiger and her amazingly creative artwork is hanging inside the pop-up shop. Tell us a little bit about uh, your creation. Yes sir, a lot of play with color and shapes, I'm thinking about central shapes um, and outside shapes, how they play with each other. I used glitter in one piece and uh, that was fun. Um, yeah, lots of different color combinations. And where can we find your artwork in, in New York? Sure, you can go to Janet Kernatowski Gallery. It's a gallery in uh, Greenpoint, Brooklyn. You should make the trek and go out there. It's, it has fabulous work. Is there anything, you know, that you want to give us a tip on when it comes to art and fashion? Definitely, if you're purchasing art, buy what you love. Hey, and now I'm out front with John Knowles, CEO of Pan Man Productions. The pop-up shop wouldn't be happening if we couldn't collaborate, John. What do you think of the future of fashion? The future of fashion lies right here. John, you're making me blush. I had to go bold. I had to go bold with the eyes, with the dress. I think color is it. I'm full of cliches tonight. That's, a, that's my first. Look, Pan Man Production does art, it does the pop-up shop, it does films. It's all about being big. Well, I think that stopping traffic in Midtown is a step towards going big. And I have to say, as an entrepreneur, speaking to another sexy entrepreneur, you have to go big or go home. Go big or go home. In the meantime, come to the pop-up shop in Midtown Manhattan at the Roger Smith Hotel. You heard. Word.